Hey guys, so if you haven't seen the other two videos that go with this series, then I will put a link in the description below so you can see both before this one. Thank you, and let's get to it. So Frank took me to a movie with his sister, whose husband did not want to come, which I kind of get because I'm shy myself and I wouldn't necessarily want to go, but at the same time I would like to meet this person who might possibly marry my sibling, so anyway. He asked what computer games I liked, and I said that I had really enjoyed the Prince of Persia Sands of Time game. I had played other games online, but I hadn't really enjoyed them. Um, then he did something totally out of left field. He offered to buy me a computer so we could game online. I was surprised at this, and in all honesty, I wasn't really interested. I thanked him, but told him I did not want him to buy me a computer. I really wasn't interested in playing, and I didn't want him to waste the money. And I really didn't want to waste time at the risk of becoming addicted to a video game and neglecting other things and the people in my life. I remember, like, I think he told me, to, like, just to think more on it, like, whether or not I wanted to play the game, so he just was like, okay, just, you know, maybe think about it more and then let me know. And I was kind of <laughs> a little bit exasperated because it was like, no, like, legit, I really don't want you to buy me a computer. Like, thank you, but please don't buy me a computer. <laughs> Anyway, so we arrived at the theater, um, but we hadn't picked a movie beforehand. So he went ahead and picked a movie, which would have totally been fine, except I have a thing where I just don't watch regular movies, period, because I don't get a good feeling when I watch them. It was a war movie with a bunch of popular actors like Brad Pitt and so on, but I just wasn't into those sorts of movies. I was horrified during the movie at what I was seeing, but more than that, I felt terribly uncomfortable. This was a rated R movie with gore and violence and sex, and I was not interested. I wish now I just walked out of the theater, but instead I stuck it out. Which was dumb, because I still remember all the terrifying parts of that movie, so... <laughs> By the time we left, I had a really sick feeling in my stomach. We went to a fast food restaurant. We talked, and we had a decent time. Frank's sister helped with that, I think. She did a fair amount of the talking, which I was actually really grateful for. After dinner, he took me home and walked me to the door. We talked for a second, and he stepped toward me, opening his arms as though to give me a hug. What I did in reaction, whether out of instinct or a brain hiccup, I'm not really sure. But at the same time he was going to give me a hug, I extended my hand for a handshake. <laughs> we, we both just kind of uh, awkwardly stopped, and he uh, hesitantly shook my hand, in which just, you know, increased the awkwardness. We'd been on multiple dates at this point, so a hug shouldn't have been a problem, I, I guess, but my oddly instinctive reaction of a handshake was probably a clue that, subconsciously at least, I was not as into this guy as I thought I was. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you liked it, please click the like button, comment, or subscribe for more videos like this. Also, don't forget to ring the bell because otherwise you may not get the notifications for new videos. Thanks! See you later!